Hello everyone, welcome back to Fable Human Age of Wonders. For the Grand Chieftain Hesesic, Chosen of the World Serpent. Welcome's a brand new patch. The Wolf Update 1.2 is here, and you can find the full patch notes in the description down below if you are interested. For the most part, it was fixes, but there was one major change. A lot of contention has been around the new mechanic Leadership Clash. And so, they decided to address it by removing it. Leadership Clash isn't a thing. Not for the AI, and not for us. That's pretty cool. They said they'll be taking a look, of course, at uh, heroes and how they want them to mechanically function, and uh, we'll readdress it in the future. But they did keep the whole AIs will have a cooldown in between recruiting people based on the difficulty you are on. On our difficulty, a very hard, it'll be one turn cooldown between the AI spamming out their glorious heroes. So we are raising the first landing to the ground because, of course, this was Blint's capital city. Emphasis on the word was. Past tense is important here. We have destroyed the world's greatest nuisance, and even though raising a city is an evil act, let's all be honest. This is perhaps the greatest thing one could do for the greater good. For the world at large. Which is now very much in our control. We're, um... We're doing well with our alliance between Moradin, who, by the way, is on his way to Shar's palace right now, as we speak. Hopefully following our bounty. Why is Shikinister taking so long? And Shikinister, who right now is taking her sweet time and fighting Asgoroth on our behalf. Come now. You can do it, my dear Naga Queen. I believe in you. Anyway, she's fighting Asgoroth on our behalf, so we'll leave at least pretty much just Medeus for us right now. Of course, we'll probably have to go finish the others off personally. You know how it is. If you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. But, um, first things first. There is a crocodile thing here. Interesting. We might be at the point of the game where I start cutting the intern times. I think that's where we're at. As Morden takes his sweet time thinking about life. Look at him. Where are you going, Morden? If you could distract Shar from me, that'd be great. Because Shar had a little bit of a kerfuffle with me here. I did get to keep his outpost, though. So that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. Yep, it's time to cut. <laughs> But we'll watch Morden fight Shar. Really? You couldn't. Oh, wait. He totally could have detached Morden and started that fight. Well, Shar's gonna come brutally murder him then. We have located a mana node with our wayward army of Lacerti, Stormcaller, who wishes to flee. Alright, off we go. Farm back those good boy points. Ooh, who's this? Uh-oh. You know what? We'll just let the Serpent Hunk go away. It's fine. It's not like I want Serpent Hunks to begin with. Now, the question is, do I actually take this city or... or excuse me, not take it, but subjugate it, or am I worried about Shar? I think we're going back. Because I do not want to lose all these young dragons. Remember, these little dragons are gaining experience every single turn. They are here in this party. Thanks to uh, Iska, who has taken the place of Resh, who was stolen from us. Unfortunately. You are healing, and it's going to take a sweet long while. Oh, geez, army heal. I did feel like you did a lot. Remember the day of being able to spam that stuff out? You know what? We'll get another one in the pocket. I have 160 casting points, which isn't bad. So do we begin our press towards Medeus with a double stack? Well, I suppose we shall. Might be time to get Lacerti involved. We'll see. Oh, another tip I received, thank you very much, is I was trying to get to this crocodile den, and I couldn't, which kind of surprised me, but I think the reason is... 
because my distance is being calculated like in this weird curve because I don't have a connecting thing here. So we'll grab this quarry and in theory, that should extend my range this far, I hope. We'll see. Well, I think Kassesic doesn't have to wait here. I think he can just begin the slaughter. Oh, look at that. We can start. Probably going to lose this Animist, I think it is. But I don't really care. Or not. Sweet. We're doing great. We could have the Witch Beast. You know what? He's healthy enough. He can come stand down here. Make sure the city isn't taken by that. Who knows what the AI is going to do? I don't know what the AI is going to do. The AI is going to do what the AI is going to do. Wrath of the Emperor is ready, but we don't need it right now. We're doing fine. The Exploiter is in. This is for Iska. I don't even remember what I put on this. Oh, yes. A Giga Crit. That's right. I recall now. And the reason I did Giga Crit is because... Hey, look. Trash. I have other spells to cast, and I keep forgetting about that. We have Flame Burst Weapon and Artisan's Armament, so we'll put Flame Burst in the queue. Because that'll be, uh, that'll take all of our casting points. Bounty update, don't care. Friendship between Moradin and Asgoroth. Hmm. We may not be so different after all. She likes that I have a weaker military. I have a weaker military? Are you out of your mind? Probably could have sold some of those, but I don't care. Well done, Blint. The Under Emperor's Empire is defeated. This brings us closer to victory. I agree. We do have allied victory turn on. So, you know. All that good stuff. I wonder why it's not telling me about this. Well, that's okay. It doesn't matter. Our cities are kind of jacked as they are. Look at this extension. I could take this from Morden. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're in a pretty good spot, team. We're kind of dominating economically, as to her. I have no idea what I should build. I guess we go this way and grab that. Production? I have an armor. Let's be honest, though, I'm not going to build anything here. We just need more casting points to summon more things. I suppose I could do this if we really wanted to. Which I kind of don't, because I want my Imperium to keep a rolling. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Imperium. Well, well, well. Medeus has attacked me. On top of that, she has made a critical error. You see, both of her armies are next to me, but one of them is in a boat. We'll auto this, see how it does. It does pretty good. We'll take it. Well, well, the AI has come for Kassesic. We don't mind. I don't even mind losing the Golden Wurven. I almost called it a worm, but it's a wyvern. But hey, that just cleans this up. Hmm. I don't need to do that. I don't need to do any of this, really. But I shall. It all hurts, doesn't it? <laughs> Everything is in pain. Oh, speaking of pain, over here, somewhere, yes. I forgot this free city was lost, but uh, guess what? We can take it back. And just like that, we have saved our vassal. Our useless vassal, but our vassal, nevertheless. Something just exploded there. We'll take that stone and we'll give it to him. In one turn, I suppose. Fair enough. I'll just keep the stone. Don't worry about it. Alrighty, this stack. Mm -hmm. What is this stack doing? I guess you can wait here. We're waiting for dragons, because dragons are cool. Literally no other reason. And I don't suppose you need to stand here anymore. Alright. Thank you, go. Got some good back and forth going. 
there a city down here? I don't believe so. So we'll just march into Pasnibor. This once belonged to Blinty Boy himself, but it does no longer. I'm glad I checked your movement range. You have secured Flameborough. I'm proud of you. Well done, well done. I believe it's time for you to come assist with the conflict. We're fighting a lot of people. Artisan Fortifications is in. Do I even get fire? Do I even care? I don't really. Now this I also kind of sort of don't care about. But I do have a lot of... Okay, we'll take this. Sure, why not? The Monument of Supremacy is in. Give me the convent. We are getting another hero in one turn. Docks would like some production. Sure. Build a fortification. Everywhere gets a fortification. You get a fortification. You get a fortification. You get an archery point. Proud of you. Flame Burst Weapons is in. This will give 20% crit chance and an explosion on kill to... Pretty much everything. Pretty much. And then we will want to get the artisan armaments ready. Do the same thing. Well, less explosions. Or crit, though. And we can now get the battlefield looting. This is pretty good, but it's one of those it's better early things. Our economy is pretty spicy right now, so... Don't really feel a need for it, to be honest. I wouldn't mind this, though. Focus studies is pretty good. Pretty good. So let's go with that, because I love knowledge. This will give research post plus five mana, knowledge and conduits plus five mana. We're going from 1843 knowledge and 1445 mana to 1953 knowledge and 1522 mana. Not bad. Not bad. We have some remains, and unless this is a baller remainer, baller remains. Which it's kind of not. It's better than some of the stuff we've seen, but um, we'll pass. Morden has withdrawn. I told you, Morden, you had to take a single unit and attack the outpost first. Why do you never listen to me? Oh, we captured somebody. Look at that. Are you a Molman? You are. You know the rules. And so do I. A Molman must die. Friendship between Moradin and Asgur. Oh, Asgur out the cluttered on Moradin now. Okay. A province was pillaged by my vassal. Well done. Well done. A treaty has expired. Uh, Mana for gold. And now more treaties have expired. I feel like there's a bug with these treaties. Because I don't know if you've noticed, but they're all the same. But I don't think they were originally. But anyway, I can make a bounty. Would I like to? Hmm. Not really. See, I already have a bounty for the Pals of Lost, which has been hilarious. And um, I'm pretty keen to keep that going. Day 101. During the siege of Effencraz, a group of captured citizens are presented to you. It's a group of distraught, pink-deep invaders from Effencraz who try to escape the underground sewers. Regardless of their origins, they all look equally bedraggled. That's a fun word. And scared as they are pushed towards you. One of your soldiers speaks. Our scouts found them, my grand chieftain. We're sure we can get some useful information out of them. Your soldiers have captured fleeing nobility from Effencraz. What do you do with them? Well, I am kind of a good-ish character, but as mentioned, the pink deep invaders get no mercy. Kill them and throw their heads over the city wall. That should weaken the resistance. Now we're going to vassalize them. I'm sure they'd love being vassalized after I just did that. I'm sure they wouldn't have any conflicting feelings about that at all. Do I go deal with this? Oh, Shara's coming. I think I'll leave this alone, team. 
Char has a lot. Char is doing a lot. I think, um... I think we're getting out of here. I could start a war on two fronts again. That's something I could do. Alright. Let's do it. So we have Kassesic. Kassesic must pursue the... The facet. So he's coming over here to deal with Medeus. I suppose we can send the Witch Beast. He has fun against the... Oh, well, maybe I shouldn't. The Undead are resilient against the Bone Dragon shenanigans. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. I also just realized I'd never built... Or never obtained a better uh, siege weapon. Hmm. Conflicting that. Alright, I guess what we'll do is we'll chill here. We'll try and get another stack going. Divkasasic. Yeah, we'll have Kasasic, the Witch Beast, and uh, this guy, Halo, go in this way, and then we'll bring everyone else north to face off against Char. You are being... Okay. How do I get there quickly? I suppose I could recall. Artisan Armament is in. This will give 30% crit to basically everybody. That's why this combo is absolutely insane. And now we've basically won. So. That's fun. Get an army heal on Kassesic. Who needs it more? And I suppose it's time. Do I recall ruler? Sure. Just recall ruler. It's cheaper. It's easier. We'll get her done. Does that mean you're going north? No, you're coming down here. Yeah, yeah, you're going north. Let's get you to the teleporter. A beacon of valor. Great. Iska Life Tanker. Her name is so appropriate. You have all of that stuff, which is great. I'd like to get you the phase support thing too, but let's get let's get you fighting first. Let's make you a combatant. Make you worthy of your name. Oh yeah, I have this as well. Who shall be? My champion. Oh, they fixed the bug as well. Where, uh, when you clicked on this, it would always go to the first one. I hated that bug. It came back. And now they fixed it. So, um, thank you. I say... You know what? We'll give this to, um... To Iska. Because she's going north. She's gonna have a hard time against Char. She's leading dragons. And we can get a hero. Now. Hmm. What type of hero do we get? Ah, my trash lizard men. I want to love you. I really do. Alas. I think it's time that we get a magic character. And I suppose... We could go... I mean, Lucky's pretty good. Chitter King Stealer. Let's get Anastasia. She can be uh, our magical sharpshooter. <laughs> it just works. It just works. It just... Can you be mounted when you have an orb? I don't remember. I don't know. But, on that note, we need an orb. Let's make an orb. There were a few fixes for this as well, but I don't remember the details. As always, if you'd like to be reminded, you can find the patch notes in the description down below. So, what type of magic would you like? You are going to go... I mean, if you're going north, we want some radiant damage. Asgroth will be resistant to fire. 
Medeus will be resistant to probably this stuff. Alright, we'll go Radiant. That's fine. A Radiant Orb. Hmm. Frenzy. I mean, Magical Slayer is basically everything on Shar's roster. So we're going to make her an anti... An anti-undead thing. There's Undead Slayer as well. Yeah, let's do it. She probably went for that major transformation, right? Then we'll get uh, just some crit chance, I guess. I have never made a weapon on Deathbane. Shysis Bane? That's Warhammer, though, right? Shysis is the lore of death in Warhammer, I think. But it sounds cooler. <laughs> Shysis Bane. There we go. We'll make it. Spells ready to launch. But oh yes, of course, the Wrath of the Emperor. Morden has returned. Hello, Morden. And naturally, we need to refresh all of this. You know how it is by now. Let's get a some elemental. Shall we get? You know what? Let's get visions of well. I'd really like if we do any like chaos playthrough. I definitely want to try, like, a Visions of Woe fumble mechanic stuff going on. Definitely. Pack leader. You know where this is going. Inspiring, defensive, strength. Endurance, animal handler, spur to action. Cool. But because we're going orb with her, we're now going to get her. Magecraft. Resistance. Magecraft. Unfortunately, I don't have a bow right now, or an orb right now to just give to her, but don't worry about it. It'll be fine. Let's go fortune. Oh, casting points. That's cute. Why do I have three things for true sight? What are we true sighting? Well, whatever. It's fine. We'll get there. So you're going north. Um, I do have something of a stack already over here. Right? They can come into this. Although I need to do something with it. How do I make this more magnifique? Bring these guys. This is a weird stack, but I respect it. Kind of. Put you back for now. Morden has returned. We have a war party coming our way, but I don't care. My domain has been invaded. Very rude. She has a frost dragon as well. Yeah, Shar is coming. How much I can do about that? Do you have any culture units whatsoever? Here you go. You are white? Are they whiteborn? Char, are you whiteborn? Did you do the thing? Why are you not whiteborn? <sighs> well, the good news is that most of her army is not cultural, so the whole Shysis Bane thing is still going to be cool. The Wondrous Fair, whiteborn. Did you give whiteborn to a culture? Whatever. Kaboom! The city is no more. Look at all of this beautiful expansion terrain I've made for my lovely new vassal. You deserve nothing less, my new slave. Friend, friend. They're slaves. Slaves. I've brought slaves. Alrighty. Good talk. Let's, um, expand to somewhere not useless, which is becoming increasingly difficult to find. 
But I suppose any production that's not uh, being utilized goes into gold, so that is fine. That'll do. You are going north. Would you like to assist in this conflict for a moment? You can't. Huh. This could be bad, actually. Depending on what that is. We'll see. Would you look at that? It's another vassal. So you're coming over here. Did I say Lazarte was going north? I've already forgotten. I think I did. Yeah, she's going north. That's why she was going near the Chrono Gate. Hello, friends. So we'll have uh, our Shysis Bane, Lacerti, and then our Dragon Doomstack. And that'll be that. Our Doomstack should have a Scald in it, but, you know. I do kind of wish I stole or borrowed a unit here. Like, one Shrine of Smiting against the Undead is supremely great. So I think I'll borrow this. Seems good. You chill. You chill. Focus of Devastation is in, and now it's time for yet another tome. Ah, glory. So we have gone and done the Wombo Combo of the Gods. Oh, look, 1993. I was born the year before that. And now that we have the, the Wombo Combo of the Gods, I suppose it's finally time for Zeal. The fervor of righteousness is a gift unto your subjects. When it courses through their veins, they become mightier, more valiant. They brush off their wounds and any pain, shielded by the holy knowledge that they are in the right. Those who reject your gift shall know condemnation, and it shall wither their very souls. Indeed it shall. So we're basically here just for the the zeal, the legion of zeal. Which, um, go a long way to helping us be glorious. We're going to recall ruler. I have to click my ruler. I broke the stack. Because it brings just the ruler. But why do I have a golden golem? Wait, what just freaking happened? I am incredibly perplexed at what just occurred. Well, that's fine. We'll deal with it. It brought my golden golem and my ruler. Did... That doesn't make any sense. I was going to say, did the unit here spawning break my stacks? Because I was standing on this tile and it booted me out. But then why did it combine... Why did it split it? I don't know. It's fine. It's fine. Let's build an abbey. Which is cool. Like abbeys. Build it there. Now I'm going to expand because why not? And look, I can access it. Thank you very much for that tip. I appreciate it. So let's build a, a farm. That allows us to build the Meyer Crocodile Temple. Which will start converting all of this desolate trash into actual useful terrain. I.e. swamps. Do I actually have a place to build this? Sure. Who needs gold? Focus crystals were obtained. Nice. I still only have one arcane anymore, but... That's what it is. Am I done casting stuff, or do I have to keep casting things? I think we're done. Oh, just kidding. I have all this to cast. But first... I 
have to give you a stone, and then I can cast it again. Next turn, of course. I really, really hope I get to play a Wizard King next campaign. Unfortunately, my priorities have shifted. Really? Well, it's a good thing that my vassals are still going this way. A new rally has begun. I'm going to take another shrine. That's all I'm going to take. <laughs> I think that's all I'm going to take, Bone Dragon. Watcher Scald. Uh, the Phoenixes are good because they are empowered, despite the fact that I'm not a fan. Uh, do I even want a bone dragon? I'm about to get, I'm about to get five golden dragons. Two bone dragons is good enough. City was released as a vassal. Yes, they got my stone. I am being pillaged by this garbage. And I wouldn't say I have a good response team. Yeah, this is not inspiring confidence. What is this? Yeah, he's not inspiring confidence. Well, that's what the teleporters are for. I'm sure we can find something to go back and deal with the insolent invaders. Oh, look at that. Blint's little hero has come at... Well, Blint's... Formerly Blint's little hero has come at me. Countess Yelenvira Vog of the Frisi Siglgrad greets you with hostility. No, I'll raise you too. Tell me I won't. How many good boy points do I have? Ooh, maybe I shouldn't raise you. I'll think about raising you. Hmm. A lot going on over here. A lot indeed. Alright, so what do I want to replace this shrine of smiting with? Probably the Watcher. The Watcher's done well for me, but I think it's time that we get an upgrade. I think it's time. This is a weird stack, but I have had weirder. So, there's that. Yeah, okay. Fair enough. Alright, let's bring this Scald home. I think what we'll do is once we get um, our rally units, we'll go deal with that uh, incursion. I don't want to build any of those. I don't care. Uh, Kasesik needs to reunite with his stack, which is only half of his stack. These two aren't part of it. There you go. Reunited, and it feels so good. Now we have the Witch Beast coming. Witch Beast, of course, is here to aid the Great Scaled One in his conquest. And we have this tank just chilling for now. Yes, you chill. You're all here. Soon we march. Face Shaw with our vassals, who are actually doing some respectable work. And the Watcher is going to go uh, join this deck. Cool. We are at 140 fortification. Pretty good. Pretty good. Everywhere is building walls. You love to see it. Faithful Whispers on Effenkraz, the absolute scourge of the earth. Sure. It's pretty magic. Let's go. Again, not, like, great, this battle mage support stuff, but it, it'll be something. We've captured another pink deep dweller, and you know what that means. Always getting my help up. They have to die. A war party. I was complimented for killing the pink deep dweller. A diplomatic approach will assure victory, will it? Wait a minute. Hmm. For once, I have more affinities than the AI. 
Interesting. He trusts me. Wow. The size of my empire is threatening them. Mm. You also trust me. I also have more affinity than you do. Wow. I guess the AI doesn't place a whole lot of importance on late game uh, research. Which I suppose makes sense to an extent. Pull out that. No. Oh. oh, whatever. Only one unit is left here, so I'm going to go waddle down there. My domain has been invaded. By what? Hey, look, these guys are... <laughs> this guy's watching you. Get it? I'm kind of surprised Shar has left this outpost here, but um, that's fine. Here's Shar herself, riding a pig. Why are you like this? Dun, dun, dun! It looks like Morden has finally, after many turns, failed the bounty. That's okay, Morden. It happens to all of us. I can no longer beat this deck. I thought they had left. That's okay. Because now I can. Probably. We'll see uh, what the AI has in store. Alright, Kasesik is joining us over here. You guys are all chillin'. Did you break my stack? You did. It's weird. I mean, it didn't break. It reassembled itself. So who did you kick out? My healer. Very rude. I also realized... Oh, did you have a fairy? What? Okay. I want Double Bone Dragon, which I know is kind of silly. But it's also amusing. And isn't that what's really important here? Yes. Yes is the answer. I only have... Do I have one of these? I think because it's a new unit, I should use it. Well, they'll still with us. Uh, they'll stay with us until Kasesa catches up. And now we're gonna go crump these guys with our bizarre stack. I'm not gonna make the same mistake. So what we'll end up doing probably is bringing units over here to not correct that, but make it slightly less painful. I suppose we could bring units from here. Yeah. Hey, look, an armory. Well done. Well done. I need one more farm. Farm. Look at those swamps. Look at these beautiful swamps. Encroaching upon the territory of the ice. Of the Vata. Our capital city can annex. Not that. I should have someone come take that, actually. The focus of devastation is ready. This is a very good enchantment for battle mages and supports. Because it has a chance to break defense mode, so it could be very good. Well, I suppose the last thing to do is to get phase going. If I cared, which honestly I don't. I suppose we'll bind some ancient wonders. For fun. Asgaroth has withdrawn to the astral void. Interesting. An alliance between Asgaroth and Morden, that's not good. Let it be known that Shar has crossed you. Okay, cool. What? What? You're going to decline. I didn't even need to call her to war. But Shar is on the other side of the map. I, I, I can't understand this. 
Where did the stone come from? I like how it showed F and Kras. Okay, that's where it came from. It showed F and Kras, even though I was targeting this place. Okay, look at that income. Oh my goodness. Wait, can I make that better? Holy shit, I can. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, order's pretty good, it turns out. Here's a stone for you. Province is being pillaged, I'm aware. Um, so I'll stop, can't, I'll get another whispering out, because uh, we have a new vassal. Ready to join the Legion and die for the world serpent. I don't think I need anything else here. I think we're chilling. I think we're being... Although... I'll take you. I'll take a blessed soul. Why not? Well, that was a chill turn. See, I'm, this is what I do, by the way, when the when the turns are getting this long. I come down here in the underground and hide in the corner. Because um, it doesn't render animations that aren't on the screen. So that helps shorten the time. I wonder if they broke it. I don't want to... I don't I don't want to start any accusations or anything. But... Everyone remember when the turn times were really, really, really long? And they fixed it? And now they're really, really long again? It makes you think, you know? I still need a siege project. Like a siege weapon project. I could attack you. That's fine. Hopefully you attack me. You are correct. Head here. Alright, you guys are going to try and help me. That'd be great. You could. If you can't, so be it. You guys are going to go murder stuff. Sounds fun, doesn't it? I like how I had my eye on the city from a long time ago because of the ore that was here. And it just... It evolved into, like, full-blown conflict with Shar. Okay, speaking of... Shar is not nearby, so I can actually go here. Uh, but I cannot siege this turn, so instead we're just going to chill in our territory and heal up. Go! Cool. Legion of Zeal is in... Uh, do I get this? No, I don't care. I, do, I don't. Don't care about that either. Can't use Draconian Transformation. Am I just about to get all of the, the Battle Mage upgrades without having many Battle Mages? I think I am. Oh yeah, I need to give you your Anastasia. Come down here to Skywatch. We are ready for this. The rest of our casting points are sunk into this, but there's something else I need to cast now. We'll get around to it. New Empire skill is available. It is... Specialist Districts. Not worth the Imperium, in my opinion. Shysis Bane is in. Fantastic. Anastasia. Excuse me. Anastasifa. Anastasifa. I'll, I'll say it right one day. There you go. Congratulations, this is the first time I have ever made a weapon targeting specific unit types. And you are the proud owner with a golden wyvern. Well, it's just called a band, but uh, windshield is typically pretty good. Uh, inversion is broken, I think. Maybe just a specific inversion item. Ah, uh, these are just all pretty bad, but take the channeling mantle. Cool. Jacanister has withdrawn to the Astral Void. We've captured a Lacerti. Wow, would you look at that? Zealous Ring. Oh yeah, someone mentioned a combo about that. Why is my... Why is my... 
friendship expired. Huh. And you're declaring friendship. Will you answer my call to war? Oh, that's against Askaroth. Okay, I'm not even gonna try. <laughs> I'm not even gonna try. I can make a new bounty. <sighs> I have to capture the heart of Askaroth myself, so. All right. Well, that's fine. You go do your thing. I'll keep doing mine. Well, well, well. Segelgard's final desperate attempt to protect itself has failed. What a shock. A local tournament is hosted at your city of Cormir Swamp. My capital city. Game. The city is well known for its local military prowess, and it shows. Cheers echo through the streets as contestants clash in the city square. Although each round is harmless in nature, the duels get more serious as victory draws closer. Eventually, one contestant, a primal charger, kneels before you, badly bruised, but victorious. How would you have the winner serve you? Congratulate and praise the winner for her well-deserved victory because I don't need any of those other things. Okay. I'm not scared. But this is a very weak stack. Fighting against a pretty juiced one. That is horrifying. It's like a T-posing phoenix. So, I'm going to wrath it. And we'll go from there. Of all the things, you had to kill a scald? <sighs> There's no hero here. What I could do... I could make an actual decent stack here. And just have them clog the cave. And what does this need? The front line? Give it a treasure. So now, if one of them want to come out from here, they have to fight this stack precisely. Asgroth has lost this binding because my dear queen, who is uh, currently throwing a little bit of a hissy fit, don't mind her, has uh, taken it. Well done. Don't worry. You will one day, once again, be on fantastic terms with her, I'm sure. Right, and now I dumb in. I think these stacks are pretty good, team. I don't think I need to replace anything. Like, honestly, maybe just the Animist comes out. The Animist is cool. Ah, it's cool, though. Thematic, call that. Alright, we'll pull that with you. That's fine. Iska Life Taker is going to take the life of the city. Does that make sense? I hope so. Four turns. Four turns for a vassal. Oh, dear. Oh, this would be a good addition to this team. Yeah. Actually, this would be a good addition to any team. TBH. And I know one team that needs a good addition. Celestial Haven. Oh, I guess I'm building healing spires everywhere. Why can I not build from this? Hmm. It'd be very cool if you could build from that tile, I think. Or that, you know, menu. That's fine. 
New Empire skill is available. It is Teleportation Mastery. I did not think I'd be getting this talent this game, but it's a pretty good one. So, you know what? Asgoroth has returned. Shikanister has returned. Allow me to declare friendship once again. Oh, no. Shar has withdrawn to the Astral Void. Very good. We have collected the remains of Yelin Virvog. Do you have trash? She has trash. What even question is this? Of course she has trash. We have captured another member of the Pink Deep Invaders, and you know the rules. Execute. You're a barbarian, though. You get to live. <sighs> Join us in our war, Kassesic. Together, we will crush the pathetic Naga erudites. Nope. Now, I wonder why this is happening. But I... Is this happening because I broke... She broke my alliance? Unfortunately, that cannot be done. A free city has declared on me. What a shock. Rivalry ended between Shar and Shikanister. A bounty has been posted to capture Istosefivil. I'll accept that, sure. Free city can be integrated. Don't care. Negotiations succeeded. Cool. I have declined a call to war. I have. Yes. Because, um, no. That's my queen. Well, well, well. Look who's coming. She wants to pit a mere frost dragon against the witch beast. It's gonna take two turns of vassalize, bro. I'm like right here. But good news, we can all stand inside the city. Medeus has bound a golden wonder. An Ariat Sanctum. I wonder if the AI knows how to crack the vaults. Hey, shall I do it as well? I can do it too, bitch. Now, the reason to do this, um, I mean, you know, besides it being magical victory condition, is it gives you 50 knowledge each time you bind a wonder. I wonder if that is depicted. I think it goes to the city, right? Domain. Find gold ancient wonder, plus 50, cool. That was actually bugged before this uh, current patch, so. Glad it's working again. Love knowledge. I love magical victory. Uh, someone pointed out that I've done more than I thought I did. Because, uh, I just love it that much. Get each magic going. You require orders. Sweetie, sweetie. Because Essek will hold the line. I might as well get to find... I might as well get it, sure. I wasn't sure if the reduction stacked on it. Lure of the Horde, Rite of War, eh. Trash. Shall we get Teleportation Mastery? The, Ironically, while the movement part is really good of this, but the best part about this is the fact that Teleporters now grant 15 mana instead of cost 10 mana. Although our mana economy, as you can see, is not really hurting. But I'll grab it anyway. I have the casting resource, right? Okay. My declaration of friendship has ended. It has. Let me uh, re-up this. And we can propose in two more turns. Okay. Got it. I wonder if Medeus will try and come at me. Let's find out. Well, it looks like she has decided to come at me. All right, foul heathen. Medeus herself is not here, so if the auto is good, we can take it. Actually, Medeus herself is here. She's just a dipshit. And it was pretty clean. The AI did almost kill the Witch Beast. Um, but hey, that's just another day that ends in Y. Alrighty. Medeus has made a critical error. Not this, well, this is a pretty bad error as well. Do not kill the Witch Beast. Don't do it, AI. I know you want to. There you go. Uh, this is a pretty critical AI or error, but this 
This was awful. And you know what the worst part about this is? I still have rules to obey. I mean, I realize I can bend the rules however I so desire, but... <sighs> we do what we must. Where are my skulls? Uh, brain? Function, please. Go here. Very good. Go here. Very good. Great. Everyone's going to be nice, happy, and healthy. You may be wondering. Hey, just kill it. You don't need to do all this healing stuff. And you're right, I don't. But, I want to make sure I don't lose anything for some stupid reason. You know, like the frost dragon flying in and breathing on me. We'll just give all of our heals to the witch beasts. It'll be fine. And next turn we win. Okay. I'm gonna pull the missling back because he's about to die. Alright. Oh, I didn't move this guy up. Alright. GG, everyone. We'll sound the anthem of victory. I'm not the only one who thought that the phoenixes could teleport, right? Was that a thing? Wow, you had a good retaliation. Alright, how do I do this in the most busted way possible? I feel like it involves... I need just a little bit more movement. Okay, I suppose what we can do... Of course. I was gonna say, I suppose what we can do is get some sacrificial lambs, but naturally... The moment that happens, we summon a fire elemental. The least sacrificial lamb of all of them. Surprise! Can I line this up? I sure can. Look at that. That's pretty good. I liked that. That's pretty good. Well, I suppose we can rally here. Can I get you in? Can. Cool. Farewell. And that's Medeus down. <laughs> Can anyone else get in? I don't think so. Alright. Oh, you can get in. Sure. Let's just swing our tail. And make everything worse, worse with Draconic Rage. And we'll go there. Our brave leader can do this. I remembered. We need to get a little closer, though. No. Here. Just, just get into touch range. It's fine. Do that. Do this. Do this. Kill it. Hey. And now we kill it ourselves. Easy. Alright. Well, another one bites the dust. I do need to heal a little bit. There's something down here. Shall we find out? What a waste. Wouldn't it be funny if just like some YOLO army popped out of there and took over the city that I'm trying to vassalize? How are we doing here? Oh, Shar's coming. 
Swiggity swooty. Just coming for that booty. So what do I need here? What are we replacing? Probably one of our skirmishers. I mean, the Frost Wyvern can freeze people. They both have the same stats. This guy slipped away. So he can slip away somewhere else. Get it? Perfect. Yes, your orders are required. I'm chill. If I need you, I'll call you. Call me Anywho, next home. What home do we desire now? We could go... I don't really need to go Exaltation. Unless I want to make my own shrines, which could be funny. Subjugation? I don't think any of this is particularly helpful. TBH. Doom Herald would be hilarious just for, like, despair. Don't really cause despair right now. Shadow's not really our thing, you know? The movies go enchantment. Enchantment? Enchantment! Enchantment. Enchantment is truly a union of the worldly and the arcane as it requires both a steady smithing hand and magical prowess. Enhance weaponry, tools of labor, and even your people to see your empire rise above any other. Interesting. Purging Arrows is what took the place of the plus one range, which grants physical ranged attacks of enchanted units plus 10% damage against magical origin units and a base 60% chance to remove one positive status effect from the target. And the effects are increased for non-repeating attacks. This was added to a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, which I think is a good change. It's interesting. It could be okay for our skirmishers, but we definitely want Sundering Blaze. It's kind of like the main thing we went for here. Uh, the shields are also good, but we don't... We have, like, two shield units, I think. Probably. If that. How's your expansion going? Slowly. The Witch Beast has leveled up. Unfortunately. How are you doing on support stuff? You're still supporting. You're getting there. I'm proud of you, okay? You're an animal handler. You don't need Demolisher. You have Demolisher. You are a Demolisher. In my heart. Halo has leveled up, and he's going to get defense. Kasesic is level 20. The Chosen of the World Serpent. A freaking dem is okay, I guess. Channel power is okay as well. I could also get the Golem Assistance. I haven't used this in a while because this is more microing, but I'll take it. Free units are free units, you know. All that shit needs to just be broken. <laughs> Plus 10% damage. I forgot that was a, a minor detail of the siege magic. We captured somebody. But, um, as it was not a moleman. That's fine. Medeus has withdrawn to the Astro Void. I did that. We are under attack, Kassesic. I had to do a bit of a cut here. Because, answer called war against Morden. I misread this at first, and I declined it. Which, um, of course, I didn't want to do. I thought that this was Morden calling me to war against Shekenister, but it's Shekenister calling me to war against Morden. Thank goodness for autosave, huh? So we are, fortunately, going to accept this. 
We hope that you will honor your oath and come to our aid. I saw that and I was like, oh, hey, it's Morden again. But um, Shikendister is calling for your aid against Morden, the Soul Forger. And um, there we go. Now, unfortunately, that will break the truce I had with him. So... Wait, what's going on with Asgaroth? Um, so, you know, that'll make me a bit evil, but what is your color situation going on here? Huh. You look weird. I kind of wish I could see you in person. That's his major racial transformation. He went for order, which I suppose isn't that surprising. Oh, dear. Well, welcome to the war, Kassesic. Does that mean that Morden declared on Shikanister? I think that's what happens. Well, our uh, Dowie friend is our Dowie friend no longer. So we might have to change course. This is going to change real fast. We're still in the... I wonder if it broke. Shall we find out? Ah, Medeus is back. Unfortunately, I'm quite wounded here, so this is a risky battle. I might have to do this manually to uh, preserve our forces. <sighs> Heavy losses. I mean, I could instantly replace, like, all of this, but... Um, I'm going to try and save it. I could be really lazy in, like, salvation stuff. But let's try and use our natural resources first, shall we? Before we resort to stuff like that. Make sure we get a mending touch. I wouldn't mind if the skull touched me. Wouldn't be a big deal. In my book. I don't believe the Witch Beast has the Primal Communion yet. No. Kind of unfortunate. Maybe I should have used that on you. Oh well. Is what it is. I really hope we can get a fat... Oh yeah, here's our little assistant golem. Hmm. I have a lot of weak here. Weak units here. I think it's a double protection too. Oh, cool. Also heals them a lot. Do you know what we'll do? We'll try and get Kassesic over here. Like that. I realize the shrine shouldn't be the one on the outside, but don't worry about it. It'll be fine. That was cool. I learned something new every day. Alright. Ooh, you have two fire dragons and two frost dragons. And an infernal juggernaut. She's a protective sage or whatever, so it's not surprising that she got one of those. So is this dome permanent? Do this again? <laughs> Interesting. We could go with a lightning storm. This wouldn't be a bad idea either. It's not great as a heal, but it'll do. You know? Whoops. I know what I did wrong, okay? I'm still adjusting. I think that as if I didn't do that before when it was just, you know, a regular heal. I think I'm still not going to move much. I think we're still chilling. You know what? I'll even do this. Why not? It's not even a good one, but I'll do it. Okay. 
can't say I like how uh, many dragons there are. Which means there's going to be a lot of breath coming my way. Let's see, what do I heal here? I should heal that if I could. I'll do. Alright, we'll chill. Did you just summon a Spear of Destruction? Or Devastation, whatever it's called? I think you did. I haven't seen that in a while. Oh yeah, you're Feudal Culture. Wait, why do you have Rising Fury? Ah, that must be how they killed the Shrine of Smiting. Interesting. Yes, breathe on the assistant. Yes, breathe on the assistants. Got my money's worth of that one. All right. Well, I'm gonna kill this guy. I hope everyone knows that. It does be oh. Okay. Non-mythic unit. Fortunately, don't really have a uh... you. You don't want me to do it, right? Yeet. Seems good. And you know what? I could have done this better. So let's rectify that now, shall we? I wish I had assassinate over here. That's what I would have used. Unfortunately, this little golem, as great as he has been, and he has been fantastic, is also in the way. Look at all the whiffed guilds. They're all whiffs. Face this way. Mobilize. I got two. It was okay. Not great, but okay. I mean, that looks pretty good. Gonna take it. Good crit. This is from Killing Momentum. Unfortunately, not too much. And now, now comes the spice. So how does your breath look? Your breath looks like that, which I'm pretty sure is how the Witch Beast breath works. I don't care that it's hitting the golem. Or the stone thing. Don't care even a little bit. In fact, I'll kill him. Tell me I won't. This is the Stormbringer. Having a blast. Hit me. I dare you. Yeah, that's a little too much friendly fire for me. Good chains. And... Death! The inescapable... End. We go here. Do that. And now I need to kill some myself. This is an archer. This no longer affects friendly units, according to the patch notes, so that's cool. Looks like the enemy is about to break. I wouldn't blame him. Don't blame him. This is here on a mount, I can't tell. No. Just eat that alive, it's fine. White wolves doing white wolves things, you know? Go insane. Okay. I mean, I could tail swipe my own stone golem again. Which, I mean, at this point... Should I even consider him my friend? 69. Nice. 
It's dangerous to bring you forward, little mistling, but I will. Oh, 36. Wow, holy crap. Um, sure, swing. All right. That was a heck of a turn. The mistling might die because of my choices. And by die, I, of course, mean... Yeah. Oh, the missing wasn't... Oh, there it is. Oh, it has slip away, doesn't it? Okay. Fair enough. Well done, witch beasts. The missling. It holds a grudge. <laughs> Blee, you craven dumps. Nice. Everything lived. Well done, Medeus. You lost again. The bounty has failed because Morden has declared war and instantly walked over this. You know, Morden, I can't help but notice that you were so eager to pounce on me. Also, why did you get so mad at me? So, I have a stronger economy. She doesn't like that. She broke our alliance. She doesn't like that. And I break treaties because she called me to war to break a treaty. Okay. Okay. Well, I was sitting on those, so hopefully that helps. I also realized that uh, Medeus didn't even bother to, like, break. She could have just walked on top of this, and that would have been that. She would have ended my, my vassalization efforts, but nope. This should be an easy auto. I hope. Just cleaning her up. No big deal. And now, we march. I could go straight for her, her capital, but I need to heal a little bit. I don't have any healing. I'm about to get my fifth stone. Where is it? Oh my goodness. So I, Dark Vigor is really far away. But we can also still get... Is it... Where is it? That's even farther away. Hey, what about the pillaging one? Okay, we can actually pillage for health next turn. You know what? We'll do that. I have to have one of them, team. This is done in one turn. This... Is a different story. <laughs> uh, uh, shite. We're going to have to leave. We're going to have to leave. Uh, this is pretty much that. It's simple. I'm going to have to go. Get out of here. I suppose we can do Bounty of the Sea here and select, well, honestly, in both of these cities. But here especially, this is primarily water provinces. Nice, so we can expand to grab the Myra Crocodile then here, which we can now use to build the temple, which we will boost to the front. And we can build a Chrono Gate here. Later. Cool. We have some remains, which are trash. Fair enough. We captured a Laerty with a huge skull on her there face, which is fine. By me. Char has returned. We got some more remains. 
rivalry between Shar and Shekinister. A treaty has been broken. Yeah. Alignment has changed. I'm now very good. Very good. Treaty broken, treaty broken, treaty broken, treaty broken. It's not my fault. Well, it's kind of my fault. City releases Vassal. Do I have a stone for you? I do, but I couldn't tell you where it is. It's probably here, right? Yes. Cool. Sagal Gaunt, give the stone. Oh, you're going to be another mana for knowledge thing. Okay. Go for the food for now. So Effenkraz can also attack Shar. I'm going to send everyone at Shar, and we're going to redirect our our efforts to Morden. Apus is besieged. That's my wonder. They're probably going to... Hmm. I mean, I could have still Zadam, I suppose, go after Morden. He's right here. I think Axward is right here as well. Let's put things up a bit. You can go up to Moradin. You can go up to Moradin. And let's see. Axward is where? Here. You can also go up to Moradin. I think everyone else is really far away. So. Oh, Oakenhold can go up to Moradin. All right. I'm not that worried as long as my capital city isn't under threat, but it could very well be under threat in, like, 10 seconds. Morden's at war with everybody but Asgoroth. I'm glad you have a friend. Also, my Imperium is crumbling because I assume this means my dragons are... are dragons. Oh my goodness. Oh, I've declared war with moderate justification. That still doesn't explain the extreme reduction. No. That's fine. It's fine. Well, well, well. Medeus is back for round three. And I'm still a little wounded. Medeus herself has returned, so of course I must do this personally. Okay. I'm debating how I do this. Okay. Best, of course, it's a fire elemental. Oh, I don't have a skull in this stack. Hmm. Well, I still think we should heal you a little bit. And because this is a little bit scary, we'll give the big heal to the, the spear boy. Um, because it's a little scary, I want to try and get a good dome here. So where is my boy? This is the golem assistant. We can have him kind of be annoying. You can go here. Don't send a poison. Go there. You know what? Go there. Go around. Thank you. I'm just trying to line up for a good dome. We can heal as much as possible. Which means I'm going to have to wait for next turn. Which is fine. Let me deal. I can uh, do a little bit of this. Can I go for, like, a Giga Dome? Might be able to. We could try. I might have to, it might be better to move Kassesic if we're going for a Giga Dome. Yeah. Probably be able to hit this guy. I think that's the play. 
down. Go there. Here. Here. Cool. Now we do some big heals on you. Touch you. Face that way. Heal up. Okay. Looks good. So. Oh, I noticed. I just I remembered. I never got the Prime Good event. Well, that was Prime Good. I'm not anymore, but. I went through like a hundred ranks of good just because of my, my vindiction against Blintz. It was worth it. Okay. Who am I kidding? Of course, it was worth it. So, if we're going to get the fattest dome the world has ever seen. Like this, I think. Oh, don't click it. Oh. For once, I'm glad I didn't click it. Okay, now I'm going to click it. Because it just goes off. Cool. Let's get you up here. Let's be a distraction. Alongside my little... Got him. And, um... Yeah. I think we're chilling. We're gonna wait one turn. In our big blob. Do I cast any spells? Let's get a purifying flame. That'll do. I don't know if... All of those are worth healing. A few of them were, I'm sure. Instantly frozen, that's fair. It is a fire elemental after all, I'm sure it's weak to ice. You silly glade runners. Ooh, this could actually be really bad. Frozen. Let us decide, am I going to... I can either Anthem of Victory, which we know how good that is, or I can Purifying Flame. Because this guy's frozen. And I don't believe I can get rid of it. I have to use Kassesic to make it happen, which is a big ask. I'll give Twist of Fate to the, the puppy. And uh, we'll get to work. Oh my goodness. Look at it. I go here. Too far. Go in here. There we go. Looking spicy. So we're not going to Purifying Flame. We're going to Anthem. Too much damage here. Oh. I just cracked this code and I already forgot. There we go. Look at all the Frozen. Oh, it's beautiful. Gonna get you want a little baby dragon? Baby dragon, bitch. You're Frozen. I can fix that. But... I want to bring you in, which I do want to bring you in. Yeah, here we go. Let's get double breath. That's a kill, but... No buts. It's a kill. We take our kills. Kills are good. You are exploding on death, which is certainly a choice. get a refresh on you after I beat the shit out of this guy. The reason why I want to use this wolf is because the, the twist of fate that I used uh, keeps its guaranteed crit if I spur to action. So, you know, it's good shit. 
I'm gonna go stand in front of this. Oh, there's a dire penguin here. Wow. Uh, so now that that's happened, we can go ahead and restore to remove the frozen and all the other crap you had. And now we can do another breath. Another one. Now we can go for some kills. Do I try and assassinate here? This would actually be a really sick lightning strike. Uh, I could try it. Let's refresh um, this guy while I'm here. Go for a Giga Swipe. It's just frozen, so... That'll do. That'll do. It's also frozen. So we'll swing here. Um, I can probably get a spear. Yep. Beautiful. Okay, I'm a big fan so far of the, uh... The Stormbringer. They've done well for me. Even when I wasn't sure they would. Boop. No boop. 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 Just keep perishing. Just keep perishing. I like the dome. The dome has done well as well. Um, we could get involved in this. I don't know if it's a good idea. Probably not. But it puts her in defense mode. It's another kill. Uh, we're going to bring the shrine forward. Keep it with the protector. Which is not you. But you. You stay here. Cool. And I think that's our turn. Not bad. That was a hero going in. And attacked the Stormcaller for some reason. I still have another Retaliate. Okay. I have some questions. Some concerns. But I'm sure... They can be resolved. Like this. Man. I do want to kill this. Can I kill this in like a... Whatever. It's fine. Do you have first strength? I think you do. I guess what that's telling me. Boop. Kasesic took the kill. Because it was always his. Ew. Stabby stab. Now we bring you up. And we go for the swing. Now, unfortunately, fortunately, I'm going to have to get everything dead here. Um, well, I suppose I don't have to. I'd like to kill everything here because if it flees, it'll just be like one tile away from me. You know? It's just going back to the capital. Which is right here. It's not exactly the most encouraging thing in the world. I think the only thing left is the giant, because the giant cannot physically break. Can I get a... one more tile. Whatever. We'll get a stab in.
Oh, I can't death them too steadfast. I would have had to... Oh. oh, hey, wow. Good shit. This is the little mistling who is looking for blood. The witch beasts. I suppose can do this. Get some uh, little heals going. Make sure our true HP is not touched. As best we can, anyway. You never know what the AI is going to whip out of its bottom. Wish the pet the, the beast could get. Primal Fury. That'd be fun. Alright. If I had gone for the ultimatum helm, whatever that was called, subjugation, I could have gotten a druid of the cycle, maybe a war breed. Could have gotten anything. Do I roll the death here, just for the lulls? Death! It is. Resisted. And I got smacked. All right. I thought I'd try. Oof. Oh. Oh, hey, the explosion hurt them. Uh, these guys are actually not lined up, believe it or not. A little surprising. Double kill. And we'll let that one guy get away. And I think that was a flawless dub. Yep. No life loss. A new day dawns. And still, we are wounded. I'm down to 40 Imperium. What the? Did my dragons evolve now? Is that what this is? Uh, what is my health looking like? Wait, why are you still here? I could have just ignored this, I suppose. I thought I saw this. I literally thought I saw this stack leave. Well. Let's begin. Getting the freaking Wizards Bombardment is like the greatest addition to any playthrough. Ever. It sucks that I'm not healing. That's going to be a really hard fight. Maybe I bring in some backup. And uh, Sigil, or Scaffold, excuse me, is finally ready to die. And all my dragons did evolve. That's where all my Imperium went. <laughs> Good to know. Make this a vassal. We'll diggy dig for them. So in case you were curious, um, each dragon is seven Imperium. Do you not have This is with the cost reduction, by the way. Yep. My stream isn't unit upkeep. Oh dear. Well that's what happened to my income. <laughs> uh, we're gonna get flame burst weapons. This is an increase to our crit chance, which scales, of course, with our weapon that gives increased crit chance and increased crit damage. Uh, I'm going to take Blink. Blink is incredible. Usually I don't get Blink offered to me. I just get Demon Step, which is okay. I'd much rather have crit, though. Or er, Blink. And crit, I suppose. Did I see a second Diggy Dig? I did. I'll help out our little vassal. Sundering Blades is in Dragon Attack. Hmm. Don't care, though. What are my shield units? A Protector, which I'm not using. Blessed Souls, and then the Exemplars. Okay, we'll get Spell Temper Shields, sure. Sure, 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 sure.
So I think these guys, once we get this vassal, um, even though Shar is looking feisty, once we get this vassal, we're gonna leave uh, and uh, make our way back home. I think that's the plan. Because Morden's coming for me. Morden is coming for me. Hero has leveled up. Halo is level 12. Now, being able to double jump might be fun. My retribution is also kind of funny. You know what? Let's double jump. Why not? You can also flame burst. The Witch Beast has spur to action. I think I should get Dome of Protection on everything as well. Dome of Protection has been really cool. Thundering Strike, sure. New Empire skill is available. It is the skilled raiders, which I do want. Um, I think raiding is an evil act, though, isn't it? Medeus has returned. Medeus has withdrawn. We have captured Bulubu Stankheart. Wow, you actually look pretty cool. Look at that. Huh. I can confirm that for the next poll, I'm almost done. I just need one more option. And I'm, I'm weighing an option that has been asked for many times. Morden has crossed you. Your only ally has crossed you. Okay. And the reason why I'm weighing it so heavily is because if this option goes through, there's no going back. It's one of those. I forgot why I was talking about that. <laughs> I got so excited about this option that I'm not going to tell you what it is. You can guess, though, if you'd like. But, um... What's his outpost for? Oh, the Archon Blood that he's standing on. Very rude. Char's coming for me. Oh no. Really? You just walked on past? Ugh. Uh. Hey, look. Sundering Blades. We also have a Whispering thing we're going to need. What do we need this on? Ah, Cycle Grad, of course, of course. Our new vassal. Um. Oh, do you have a stag mount? That's so cool. This. Oh, yes. One of the options is uh, Orion. Because I want to use these. And what better person to use this with than the, um, the Wood Elves? There's not a very good Wood Elf culture, though, to be honest. Like, it's probably going to be feudal. Which isn't great, but it's also kind of the most accurate. The most representative. But uh, yeah. The Wood Elves will be on there. I'm not sure why I was confirming that. Because of the bird guy. I've been thinking about how I'm going to make Orion. Because he looks kind of weird. He's basically like Carnunos. From Celtic. Gaelic. Mythology. One more turn. The one more. Asgroth has bound a golden wonder. Wow. You have treated your citizens in House of Night's embrace well. Now a famed bard contacts you with a charming smile wreathing his face. It is an honor to speak with you, great chieftain Kassasic. Well, serpents chosen. The flamboyant musician says, strumming a lute. I am known throughout the realm as a humble bard, storyteller, and lyricist extraordinaire. Your legend is truly inspiring to me. I simply must write a ballad about you. A song worthy of your legacy. The bard wishes to write a song. What sentiment do you wish it to convey? Well, I appreciate the gold, but we're going to, of course, go a song about benevolence. Because I have no Imperium income. Yeah. We have to try and fix that. Asgoroth has bound a golden wonder once again. So he took this back from Shkenister. He kicked her out. He evicted her. I stop sending every single one of my vassals to aid you, and you lose. How am I supposed to interpret this? How? 
All right, we have Dougie Doug, Diggy Doug, for our soon to be acquired vassal. Oh dear. I have a feeling we're gonna have to, we might have to abort this. So Morden is coming for me. You're on your way, in case I need your reinforcement. You're on your way home as well. You're chilling. At least I'm in the city in case Shar tries to attack me. You're good. You're building a chrono gate. Outpost captured. Yeah. Cormier can annex, and it shall. I could, like, start devouring safe word, I suppose. I suppose. We're what? 28. Oh, dear. Archon blood acquired because someone moved off of it, but I'll be losing it soon. Don't you worry your pretty little head. Court of Whispers. I could get a fifth stone, uh, which is certainly something, but that's like for my economy, which we don't really need more economy right now. Except for Imperium. I think I am going to take skilled raiders. I don't intend to pillage stuff, but if I need to... Oh, I could use this. Yeah, I could do this, couldn't I? Let's pop it. This is the right of enduring duty. All your units instantly gain all hit points and non-hero units gain plus one rank. So, it used to apply to heroes as well, by the way. That was nerfed. Everyone should be like legendary and whatnot. And that also gave us a metric shit ton of knowledge because of it philosopher soldiers. So our shield thing is done. And we can instantly get a chaplain, sure. Why not? And that's a new tome. We're blowing through the tomes. Did they nerf the knowledge requirements, or am I just that good? They, they did nerf the knowledge requirements. I would have already been done by now, back in the olden days. Um, how much do you think Reveler's Heart breaks... Naga transformation. Just out of curiosity. Um, we could get anything, really. The world is our oyster. You know what? Let's go Terramancy. If for no other reason than for Tremor Ritual. Which is, like, the best siege project in the game. Ignore the middling mages who seek to raise the dead or harness lightning and fire to hurl at you. These fools know not the power resting beneath their own feet, but they will. In the final moments of their insignificant existences, when you bury them beneath a mountain and rend the land beneath their cities. That's great. Show me Tremor Ritual. Do you know how long... I could have gotten Devastator's Freeze as well. But Mass Survive. That's also very good. I don't think I'm going to need it, though. I'm going to be greedy. Yeah, I see there's Earth Shatter. I see there's Seismic Shock. Where is... Tremor Ritual. Show me... The Tremor Ritual. Please. Onegaishimasu. Thank you. The game's a weeb. Char has crossed you. Char has crossed me too. My dear. Char has crossed everybody. Can't get rid of that. Yep. I can always give her stuff if we do really want to get up to 800. Yeah, yeah. This is this is not cool. Not not cool. Not cool. Killed the unicorn too. Not cool. But I did get your body, so you know what? Fair enough. 
Fair enough. Really? Bro. He's taking all my Imperium income. Oh, now you've gone too far. Now you've gone too far. Okay, this is going to be next turn. This will be ours. Just two turns. Okay, Char is still here. I have a feeling she may be stuck, but we're not going to mind that. Uh... I kind of want to mass teleport. But I'm also worried that if I do, Shars is going to run down here and kill. She can't quite reach. So what we'll do... Just make three turns because of these stupid costing points. Actually, it'll take me two turns if I do this right. Yeah, okay. I can math. So we're going to mass recall. That brings me here. Because I'm heading to the Chrono Gate. We're going to put a Mass Recall in the pocket. Okay, I'm going to do one more. <laughs> You're going to do one more so I don't forget this. Then we're going to go hide in the corner. She'll never find me. And now... Hmm. For the final real... Really? One more. Medeus has lost a binding. Interesting. I wonder who did that. Asgoroth lost a binding. Well, I know who did that one. <laughs> I know who did that one. Alright. The whole reason I did this extra turn, I think she... Well, nope. It's time to leave. She can have this back. I'm not happy about it, but she can have it back. Off you go. And we can master recall. I, I could have teleported her, but that's fine. This is safer. We'll bring you back home. Because I'm worried about Moradin. Which is not a sentence I thought I would say in this campaign. But, um, you know. This is what it is. This is what it is. Go here. Try and take my capital now, Moradin. I have an army of dragons. Which, honestly, depending on how many bronze golems he has, that might not be the big of a deal. Uh, you can go back. So essentially now what this has become is Pesesic and the Witch Beast and Halo are going to just be mauling through this little island here. Everything is going to die here. Don't you worry about it. But um, we'll be coming back with the rest of our army that was after Shar to uh, try and not die. Sound good? That's the plan. We've lost the Hidden Fountain. We'll get all this back, too. In time. Medeza's return. A friendship with me was declared. I'm so glad you declared you consider me your friend. I'm your only friend in this whole fucking world. I'm glad you've seen it. We do have a new vassal. Just kidding. This is our old vassal that we just got. Who is going to attack Shar. There you go. A Whispering Stone has returned because Sigilgrad is... Excuse me. It did that thing again. Flameborrow is now a Supreme Vassal. Which can now be integrated. A war party has come from Bendleton. We have received a message. This war of ours is tiresome. Possessing. Sometimes I wonder... If it would be better... To end it. Would it... Unfortunately for you, I made an exception for the Naga Queen. Together, we'll power couple it up and bring a new future for the World Serpent and all scaly kin. But you'll just be a third wheel. So I think I'm going to have to kill you and claim your facet the old-fashioned way. A new rally of the Legions has begun, and I need to be not picking up anything that costs Imperium. Oh, like a bronze golem. Should I get an actual Zephyr Archer? More Scalds? Caustic Worm? Should 
Sure. Why not? You know, with how much Battle Mage support I have, I feel like I should get a Battle Mage. Get a Winter Fairy. There we go. <laughs> Just to get a whole bunch of units that are Tier 3. Wow. Hey, yo. Axeword, wake up. Kill that. That's mine. Oh, that's more than himself. Oh, losing this is going to blow. But hey. Morden wants to deal with me? Is, this, is he venting his stress for not being able to complete my bounty? He's going to learn what it means to attack the Chosen of the World Serpent. Next time. So thank you all for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed. Thank you to the patrons and the channel members who support the channel. I greatly appreciate you. If you'd like to stay up to the channel, feel free to join the description down below. And I will see you next time as we deal with our traitorous Dowie, who I may or may not have betrayed. And claim yet another facet. Bye.